When you first receive your software, your security device or dongle is timed for 30 days. At the end of 30 days, you're going to see a message that says your dongle serial number with your serial number has been expired. If you have an update file, you can update now. Do you want to update? When you have this message, you need to get hold of our technical support or activate your software via our online form to request a new key file. The new key file will come to you in your email. It will come as an attachment with instructions on the email how to use this key file. Once you receive the email, then it's very simple. Let me go ahead and just say no here. This is the email attachment. You'll see it's got your serial number with a zero or a few zeros in front of it. And it's an attachment to an email. You need to save this attachment to a location on your hard drive in your computer. Once the file is saved, then we need to follow the steps in the email. So let's go ahead and download this file. If you are on Windows 8 or Windows 10, and in some cases Windows 7, your default download location is going to be the download folder. If you have the option to save as, you can save this file to any location on your hard drive. Just remember what location you've saved it to so you can access it later. So let's go ahead and download. Now that my file is downloaded, I'm going to attempt to open my program again. And again, I'm going to receive that message that my serial number is expired. This time, though, I'm going to click on the Yes button because I have the key file to update. So I click on Yes, and I locate the folder where I have saved this in. In my case, it was in the Downloads folder. If you've saved it to another location, please locate it by clicking on the Look In option and dropping down the menu to locate where that was saved. Once I locate the key file, all I have to do is left click on it to select it, make sure that it is highlighted, you'll see the file name here, and then I click on open. Now my dongle is updated and I will receive this message, your dongle is combined successfully, please restart the program after you click OK. That doesn't mean to restart your computer, it just simply assumes that you have tried to open the program. So I'm going to say OK and my program automatically closes in the case of updating a dongle that has expired.